When there is not sufficient jawbone available for the placement of dental implants, bone grafting can be used to replace or improve the volume or the quality of the jawbone. It is a surgical procedure that involves replacing missing bone with the material called a bone graft. The graft materials most commonly used are synthetic or bovine bone substitute, or the patient's own bone if we can obtain this from within the oral cavity. Grafting may sometimes be required in advance of dental implants. The grafts are required to heal for a period of about 6 to 12 months before the implants can be placed. In most cases, however, it is possible and often advantageous to perform bone grafting at the same time as implant placement when we have access to the patient's own bone during surgery. A graft is commonly used at the time of extraction of the teeth when it is placed within the residual socket to preserve the shape of the jawbone and minimize resorption. This is called socket grafting. Another type of graft is when the graft material is layered on the outside surface of the jawbone to improve its width. This is known as onlay grafting. But perhaps the most common type of grafting is the sinus graft. The sinus is a hollow cavity in the upper jaw. Being a protected space, a graft placed in the floor of the sinus is less susceptible to external influences such as pressure from a denture and is therefore quite predictable. It is today regarded a routine procedure to restore bone height in the back of the upper jaw for the simultaneous or subsequent placement of the implants. The sinus is accessed from inside the mouth and the membrane that lines it is gently elevated. The bone graft material is placed beneath the membrane. The implants can be placed at the same time or after healing, depending on the condition of the bone at the time of surgery. The grafted bone not only replaces the missing bone, but also helps regenerate natural bone and improve jawbone volume for implants and long-term support of the teeth.